Yo, good morning, wealth champions. Y'all know what time it is, man. It is the daily hustle. And today I got a question for you. How lucky are you? Today is Wednesday, October 16, 2019. You are tuning into the daily hustle. I'm your host, H. Cortez, the one and only financial health mentor from wealthcreationplaybook.com. Everybody's favorite fatherpreneur. And Y'all know the Daily Hustle is all about motivation, inspiration, encouragement, edification, and empowerment to get you to own your day today. But if they say that luck is where opportunity and preparation meets, then my question for you is how lucky are you today? What are you doing to prepare for that chance encounter with the right opportunity. And if you're not preparing, then why? See, I wanna tell you a story. Here in St. Louis, we got to live through what ultimately became known as the greatest show on turf. But what a lot of fans don't know who casually follow football is that it probably never would have happened had it not been for a little luck or opportunity and preparation meeting. What do I mean? Well, we had a quarterback by the name of Trent Green here when the Rams were the St. Louis Rams. And uh, that quarterback got hurt first game of the season, or maybe even in preseason. I can't remember exactly. And in steps a young man by the name of Kurt Warner, who is now Hall of Fame quarterback, Kurt Warner. And he was just prepared for the moment, right? Uh, he led that team to uh, two Super Bowls, one of which they won. And then he got bounced to the New York Giants where he stumbled and fell. And ultimately that quarterback and job became Eli Manning's. But what did he do after that? Went and led the Arizona Cardinals to another Super Bowl appearance, uh, in which case they didn't win. But he led three different teams to Super Bowls, two St. Louis Rams teams, and, and we do say two teams because the team, the makeup of the team changes. So uh, two Super Bowls in St. Louis, and then went and led the Cardinals to some success, including a Super Bowl appearance over there. But what am I saying that? I, I'm saying all that for, why is it, why are we talking about Kurt Warner? Because before he came and played for the Rams, he was stocking shelves in somebody's grocery store. But clearly, in addition to stocking shelves in somebody's grocery store, he was also working on his craft. Otherwise, he would not have been prepared for that opportunity. If you guys study NFL history, then you know that Kurt Warner is one of the most accurate quarterbacks that has ever played in the league. And you know what? propel someone to prepare like that is their belief. See, even when he was stocking shelves, Kurt Warner believed he was a Hall of Fame quarterback. Therefore, he prepared and trained like one. So you may be in a situation right now today where you might not be where you want to be, but the question is, are you training like you deserve to be there? Are you preparing like you deserve to be there? Are you studying like you deserve to be there? See, before it's all said and done, I will be one of the greatest entrepreneurs that this world has ever seen. Right up there with the likes of Jeff Bezos and um, Mark Zuckerberg and uh, Steve Jobs and all of those guys, right? I'm not there now but that's what's driving my preparation. So when I run into the right opportunities, I'm prepared. So the question again is how lucky are you? Hey, listen guys, do me a huge favor. Only if you got value from this video though, do I want you to like the page, uh, like or subscribe to the channel, and then make sure you like this video and share it with someone else. Maybe someone else needs their day to be bright in a little bit. Maybe somebody was about to give up and uh, because they didn't get what they wanted uh, in the time frame in which they thought they should have received it. But much like Kirk Warner, they might need to keep preparing because an opportunity is looming on the horizon. And when that opportunity meets them, 
they need to be prepared and ready for it. Also, if you have not checked out the wealthcreationplaybook.com yet, then go over there and get your free copy of the ebook and video course that walks you through not only what the six money killers are, but how to overcome all six of them at the same time with one simple solution. So until I talk to you tomorrow, I want you to get your money up because you absolutely can do it. But more importantly, you deserve to do it each and every single one of you. I hustle up.